to my channel. It's been a couple days since I have been on here. I actually had my daughter visiting this weekend. We had an amazing time and so I didn't do meal prep so I have no meal prep video coming out. My daughter went back last night. It's now Monday. We are going to do a great big Sam's Club haul today. So about every three, maybe every three months we do a pretty hefty Sam's Club haul and we just stock up on meats and things like that and then I come home and I portion them out into individual um, vacuum seal them and portion them into individual like one pound packages um, that way I can just pull it out when we want them so we're gonna take you along with us and then when we get back I'm gonna show you what we end up getting we I think probably when we get back we are going to actually unload onto the pool table in the garage because we're gonna have so much that I just don't think that it's gonna fit on my prep table in my kitchen so my husband said he can just put a tarp or something over his pool table and I can just put everything there and show you that $500 Sam's Club haul. It was actually, four, what was it, $496 something? Yeah, $496 and some change. But this should last us quite a while. We got quite a bit of meat. So I'm going to start down here. We got some refills for our plugins, some toothpaste, some laundry soap. We got these for my husband, one of these protein bars which my scanner wasn't scanning in the store. I couldn't get a connection, so didn't even think to check the back of them. We just kind of glanced real quick and then scanned them in the truck, and they are 10 points for the chocolate peanut butter and 11 points for the chocolate mint. Because we got looking, we just quick glanced at the calories and everything, didn't even think to check the sugars in there, and there are quite a bit of sugar, 17 grams of sugar. So I won't touch those, but... Since he's in maintenance, those will be good for him. I will just stay away from them, though. And then zero points for asparagus, broccoli, some vegetable medley. I still had some broccoli Normandy in the freezer, so I just picked up a thing of vegetable medley. And I think that's it for those vegetables. I picked up some albacore tuna. That's one point on green for a whole can and zero on blue and purple. Some of my husband's favorite pickles. I mentioned these when we did our last haul. He absolutely loved the, loves these pickles. They have, what's in them? Onion and garlic. Yeah, onion, garlic, a bunch of stuff in there. And then, uh, oh, I forgot about the Aleve. Some peanut butter, natural creamy peanut butter. This scanned out to six points for two tablespoons. And some Prego. This actually is Prego traditional. This scans out at three points for half a cup. But this is kind of one of those things where you can get spaghetti sauce or pasta sauce that is lower point. But we will take the points for this. We prefer this kind. We love this kind. We use it on our sometimes on our pizzas, our strombolis. We use it in our on our spaghetti, everything. So we will take the points for the flavor of that. Also got a great big thing of Quaker Oats, and those are four points for a half a cup on green and blue and zero points on purple. A couple things of Cheerios, those are three points for one cup. Got my husband a great big thing of fried pork rinds. He has been liking to dip those in the Aldi queso. Those are four points for one ounce. Um, cashews. Got some cashews, five points for an ounce, which comes out to about 44 pieces. And Smucker's Jelly, three points for one tablespoon. And then I picked up some cooking spray. I, I like to use my Misto mostly, but we do use cooking spray like for the grill or sometimes just for in the pan. I never, I always use my Misto in the air fryer because they say this cooking spray is not good for the air fryer. And then some Sweet Baby Rays, that is four points for two tablespoons. 
but that is good barbecue sauce. Yes, <laughs> Did you know that's that many points? No. Yeah. So yeah, four points for two tablespoons of that. Uh, and then I got some diced tomatoes. These are actually, the diced tomatoes in the Rotel are not zero. If you always make sure to check the back because sometimes they have added sugars, which makes them not a zero point item. So these both are one point for half a cup. And then a huge thing of Parmesan cheese, which is one point for two teaspoons. And then, oh, these turkey sausage sticks. We actually already opened them and tested them out for you guys, and they are awesome. We both love them. They're two points for one stick, and they are not the funny Weight Watchers math. They are a true two points for a stick. So four points for two sticks, six points for three sticks. And then Canadian bacon, you can actually have four slices for one point. Um, the serving size on the back, I've mentioned before, is actually for three slices, but always toggle because you can sometimes get more out of it when you toggle the amount. And then light string cheese, this is the funny Weight Watchers math. One point for one, one point for one stick, three points for two sticks, four points for three sticks. And then my husband's cheese, the full fat, extra sharp, that's four points for one ounce. Now we'll move on to the meat. So the meat we got quite a bit. I'm going to portion it out today and get it all in the freezer. So I got a big thing of chicken breast. This is a little over five pounds. Two points for three ounces on green and zero points on blue and purple. I got the 90% lean ground beef. 96% is the best. But I've mentioned before that if you're cooking ground beef, you can actually rinse it in water and make it be just as lean as the 96%. But as the way it is, it's um, five, points is for five points for four ounces. We got some, these look really good, top sirloin steaks. These are five points for four ounces. And dinner tonight. <laughs> yeah, and dinner tonight. And then check these chuck roasts out. Look at the size, how thick those are. They look so good. So these are uh, six points for four ounces. Sometimes when you, most of these don't scan. Sometimes the chuck roast doesn't scan. You have to actually search for it. Some of them you'll see where it'll say five points for four ounces. Some say six points. It sometimes depends if it was just a member that put it in. So when that ever happens, I always go with the higher points just in case. And then pork tenderloin. Um, I didn't even realize they sold those there. I got a packet of those. Two points for four ounces. And then the pork loin. That is the great big pork loin that I make into, I usually cut it into individual pork chops and then also I keep like a pork roast of it. That is three points for three ounces. That's another thing where it doesn't actually scan. Some of the things that pulled up said two points for three ounces, but since some came up saying three points for three ounces, that's what I go with. And then I got a great big thing of salmon, and that is on green, three ounces for four points, and then of course zero on blue and purple. I got a two pack of the 93% lean ground turkey, that's four points for four ounces. And then my husband's Gatorade, that's the lower sugar kind, those are only three points for one bottle. And then some Diet Coke, 35 pack of Diet Coke, we got a big thing of water, 40 bottles of water, and two things <coughs> of donut shop coffee, that's really good coffee, we actually like that. We used to use the, uh, what's the kind we used to get from Keurig? Um, donut Krispy No, the other one. Dunkin' Donuts. Yeah. Dunkin' Donuts we used to get, but this kind is, we think, just pretty much just as good. So 200, and there's 100 in each box. So that is it for my big Sam's Club haul. And then I will show you what it looks like after I cut everything up and portion it out. So if you're new to my channel, I hope you'll consider subscribing. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell so you're notified anytime I upload new content. I'll talk to you all in my next video. I'm Christy and I'm planning us healthy.